Hey, everybody. Welcome to Pace Studio on the Road. This is presented by our friends at Show X, and we are live today at the Cutting Room in Beautiful in Midtown Manhattan with Louis Cato. Louis Cato, thank you for being here. Uh, thanks. Thanks for having me. Yeah, man, it's great to see you again. Um, the circumstances could not have been anticipated last time we crossed paths, but here we are at the at the cutting room, man. Thank you so much for doing it. Man, absolutely. Thanks for having me. Yeah. Truly. It, it's a strange phenomenon to be like, oh, I'm going to go like make music outside of my living room. <laughs> Yeah, it's been a while for us too, man. It's weird to go take the cameras and the mics and the everything and go wow. to an actual place and do this, but we really appreciate you taking the time to do it. And we're about to share a lot of your music with uh, with the internet right now. What's coming up first today? Oh, cool. Well, those of you who don't know, I'm Louis Cato. I'm a Brooklyn Brooklyn boy proper uh, from uh, North Carolina by way of Dayton, Ohio, by way of Lisbon, Portugal. It's fun. Uh, I'm gonna do one of my songs uh, that is very ironically uh, aptly titled uh, Look Within. You know, COVID, it's a whole thing. It has a totally different meaning now, but hopefully it still uh, resonates with, uh, the way it resonates with me. There comes a time when peace of mind Can't wait any longer You hit a wall and start to fall There's nothing left to say And sometimes there isn't any sign Of a path that's clear to follow Most times I begin to find That it's me that's in the way I take a look at myself Take a look at myself Now I try to be a patient man When there's no way of knowing I close my eyes until I can see What's right in front of me and sometimes you don't need anyone to remind you where you're going Most times I begin to find I got everything I need I take a look at myself Yes I do Take a look at myself Find the time to step away Cause when I figure out how to settle down I know I'll be okay And it's alright mm -mm. If I wait it out The sun will rise The morning comes with a brand new light It's alright to take a deep breath and look within It's all right to take a deep breath and look within. Just take a look at myself. Take a look at myself. Take a look at myself. Find the time or make the time to step away Cause when I figure out 
how to settle down I know I'll be okay Thank you, Lewis. This sounds great, man. Thank you for taking the time to come play with us today. We really appreciate it very much. It's always a total pleasure to be around you in general. And then the music happens and it just skyrockets into the stratosphere. I feel great right now, man. So thank you. And um, I, I knew, uh, I knew Brooklyn. I knew that you're a Carolina guy as well, but I've just, just moments before you came here, uh, found out about the, uh, your, the fact that you were born in Lisbon, the fact that you were born in Port Portugal. Yeah. Um, can you talk a little bit about what you've taken, like bits and pieces of the flavor of the cultures of all the places that you've lived and, uh, and how those have informed the music that you play today? Yeah, well, you know, uh, my, a couple of my other military colleagues and friends, military kid friends, I'm a military kid, that's why I was born in Lisbon. And so I think hopping around uh, from Dayton to, uh, to Maryland, I didn't even mention Maryland, we were in Upper Marlboro for a bit. Uh, I think, you know, those were such formative years, like it was when I was learning to play drums and talk. Uh, and uh, I don't know, I think just very practically it accounts for uh, this, um, you know, my ambiguous accent maybe when uh, you know with the with this you know the ambiguously southern i guess um because north carolina was such a big part of you know kindergarten second part of kindergarten through through high school uh but i think uh i i don't know someone pointed out recently that the kind of you know i think it, maybe it 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 comes through in the the music that resonates with me uh, from the Southern heritage uh, to the, you know, the bit of the, the mid, almost Midwestern sort of thing that was happening like when I was playing drums in my church as a two, two sort of three year old um, with my mom uh, in Ohio uh, in, uh, uh, in my, uh, my godfather's church. I guess, uh, yeah, I don't. I don't. I. I think it just all kind of informs what I'm. What I'm drawn to, and you know, the the more I continue to discover who I am, I find more of it. You know, still learning about it. Nice. Well, man, we're we're very happy to have you here today. The way that all those influences have have soaked into you, and the way you put them out into the world is very much appreciated. I'm enjoying myself very much, and there's still a lot of your music left to share with the internet here today in this session. Man, what's coming up second today? Uh, second today, I figured I'd do another uh, introspective one. Here's one that um, uh, COVID time has has made releasing music just a bit strange, uh, and so. I've got a, a good amount of music that the world hasn't heard yet, and I figured maybe I'd do one of those today. This one's called Another Day. <clears throat> Sure is 
is the sun, you know what happens when we're in each other's gaze. There's no happy ending, so we vow to keep away from the flame. But as long as there is conversation here, if a promise to Contain my every tear. Another day, another day. Come back and see me. Another day. Ooh. If there's no choice, then it'll be this way. Still wanna see you another day. Figured I'd do the short version, you know. <laughs> well, dual purpose, don't give it all away. And secondly, so we get through more songs. <laughs> yeah, we will definitely have time to to hear all of them. This is a total pleasure having you play. And uh, yeah, man, we will we'll stay tuned for when that uh, currently unreleased music becomes released music. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, there's 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 a, a good amount of that. But probably the one I'm that's uh, most excited about right now is this. Um, this project called Mirrors that uh, I think is, Becca's coming on later, right? She's, yeah, you guys might cross paths loading in even, and out. She's coming in next. I, I would love that so much. As dangerous as it is now with COVID, uh, but we um, we we put together a group called Mirrors, um, a project called Mirrors that is uh, myself and Becca Stevens and uh, Gisela Joao and Mike League and Justin Stanton and. Uh, we did something really crazy in September, high to COVID, went through all kinds of crazy precautions and home testing and having to retest and missing flights because of protocols and things to actually end up all together in a house in Porto Alegre, Portugal for two weeks. Uh, and we all wrote songs with each other. We wrote and recorded a 10 song album with Nick Hard uh, in a you know, self-made studio. Uh, and that is all mixed and ready to go. It's sounding amazing, and I'm really excited for you guys to hear it. It's really special. Nice. Um, but, yeah, it's I'm coming, coming, coming soon. I think in the spring, I think someone, I heard someone say March. I'll get a better date. Becca probably knows better than me. Yeah. Um, yeah, we'll ask her about it. Man, ask well, her about it. <laughs> that's so cool, though, to have have a project. And uh, I mean, I know you're you're not uh, hurting for projects. I mean, you've got you're a busy, busy guy. But um, been, you know, it's it's blessed. wonderful to have that as yeah. opposed to the opposite problem that so many people have. There's just not enough to to do right now for so many people. So yeah. so good for you, man. I'm really glad that you were able to stay Thanks, busy Brad. that way. I appreciate that. Yeah, I, I you know I'm blessed to be working a lot on a lot of things that. My 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 youngest daughter likes to make fun of me for working so much, um, uh, and I try to take that in stride and balance it out with with my daddy daughter time. But yeah, it's good. Nice, good man. Well, it sounds like you're adapting and adjusting the the best that anybody possibly can. And, try it. Um, We've got, there's there's a lot more music, man. You're going to do one, I think that you're doing one off of starting now, right? You're going to do one next that is that is out in the world and released? Yeah, yeah. This was kind of the single that went ahead before that, that starting now record uh, called In My Reach. I should take some water because it's, uh, I've decided to not retune my entire guitar down to sing it because eh, it's a half step <laughs> for all you musos out there. Hmm. Well, I look around the corner, see everything I've hoped for in my reach. Mm -hmm. If I move a little closer, I see everything I've hoped for in my reach. In my reach mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Once again, the days are shorter. Oh, the winter's so much colder out here. In seven days, I'm one year older. Everyone else is moving forward, and I'm here. And every time I compare myself with someone else, I feel lost. And I might think I'm in parallel with someone else, but I'm not. No, no. But I look around the corner to see everything I want for in my reach. In my reach. If I move a little closer, I see everything I hope for in my reach. In my reach Oh, oh, mm -hmm. Whoa. yeah, 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 yeah mm -hmm. And they say clouds have silver borders One of these days I know the sky will open up mm -hmm. If I play my hand according to plan I understand I'm even closer than I thought And every time I, I compare myself with someone else I feel lost mm -hmm. And I might think I'm in parallel with someone else But I'm not I see everything I've hoped for in my reach, in my reach, oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah they say clouds have silver borders, one of these days I know the sky will open up. Mm, yes, it will If I play my hand according to plan I'll understand I'm even closer than I thought mm. So I look around the corner And see everything I'm hoping for In my reach In my reach If I move a little closer I see Thank you, Lewis. Thank you. Yeah, Thank man. You that was it. Was interesting to hear the um, the adaptations that you guys w underwent in order to in order to go to Portugal, do that Mirrors record. I mean, that's uh, you lot. know, there's a lot of, of extra hoop, uh, extra COVID hoops to jump through. Yeah, these shout days. out to shout out to uh, to Justin Stanton. <laughs> that man, he went. He he trans. He literally transformed himself from a from a band leader to a <laughs> um, sometimes manager, project manager, organizer, uh, just on in the nitty gritty on the phone, handling paperwork and like law changes, regulation changes, like in the middle of like the process planning. It was a, it was a lot, but so so worth it, so so worth it, man. When you hear this music, it's so unique and special and. You know, the thing that Gisela Joao is, is like an, an incredible, you know, Portuguese uh, uh, singer and like just a clash a coming together of like all the different worlds, like me coming from like, you know, 
Southern um, Americana singer songwriter jazzy something or soulful something rather a mashup of a month of a ton of different worlds just within yourself yeah and yeah. becca being like a whole universe of her own like you know her she's her music sounds like nothing else. the way she hears music everyone is everyone in that group like brought something so unique in the way it came together with the uh you know no egos it just it just allowed for something really unique and special to to happen and i'm so excited to be able to put it on Spotify and, and start posting about it and telling people. This is the most I've got to talk about it for, <laughs> since we did it. Nice. Well, thank you for doing it. And we, what, what has it been? Um, I mean, the, the whole country, the whole world has a chance to see you um, on, a, on a weeknightly basis um, on, on Colbert. Can you talk about some of, the, of what that production process now looks like and yes. some of the adaptations you've had to make there in order to make that show continue Ooh, yeah. to go? So everything happens remotely now, you know. Um, we haven't been, you know, we haven't been recording back in the Ed Sullivan Theater since March, uh, since March 12th, my daughter's birthday. Um, and, uh, oh, oh, there's a little, oh, all right. <laughs> I guess I'm sharing my apple now. He, he got away unharmed, right? They got away. They unharmed. got away. Thank you. <laughs> yes. Good. <laughs> <laughs> there was a couple. Um, yeah, Colbert is, uh, I mean, everything's been remote now. So basically for music to happen, it's got to go through a whole process that we've been work, we've been working through over the last, you know, several months i mean well however many months it's coming around to a year now yeah it's crazy to say um and it involves a lot more screen time uh a lot of like assembling parts of musicians uh from you know and l lining things up and editing and uh interpreting and making it sound as though we're playing together and fortunately we there's a great chemistry in that band between you know, John Batiste, the band leader, uh, and the, uh, uh, the other musicians, like, so, you know, there's, it's, it's an interesting coming together of, uh, of technological prowess and uh, musicality that's required to, like, put music together for the show to make it, at least with the band music and the bumpers, to make it sound like we're all playing together and everyone's kind of developed an understanding of that m deeper and deeper as we go. And then also like music for comedy is like become like a big time, you know, a, a big part of like what occupies my, my time. And, uh, it's, uh, really, you know, it's great to have been, you know, c contributing to, uh, a, a positive voice amongst the madness. Which actually ties into the, the next couple songs I was gonna do. Um, uh, we lost like John Lewis, uh, Congressman John Lewis. Uh, um, uh, I think it was this summer, uh, uh, and uh, that really resonated with me uh, for a lot of reasons. Uh, he I'm also a Southern black man. Uh, uh, a lot of the ways reminded me a lot of uh, like my father and some of my family members and a lot of stories that I heard from uh, my dad and my uncle like integrating schools in the south like when they were in high school and um, you know the things that they fought for and the things that he fought for and and what this court I think it always struck with me was watching someone, these, these, these especially, particularly the John Lewis's of the world and the Martin Luther King's of the world and the Malcolm X's of the world that dedicated their lives day in and day out with families and like livelihoods like the rest of us, but still dedicating their lives to an end of, of, a, of a hope of, uh, you know, a better environment for the world knowing that they wouldn't see it. And that was like, that's the piece for me that is just baffling, you know what I mean? To, it, we get so frustrated, I think, uh, trying to, you know, no matter what side of any aisle you're on, like, you know, I think it's pretty universal to, you know, want to be able to, you know, have basic necessities and be treated fairly and with respect. And these were things that, you know, have not historically been the case. And, you know, we've made a lot of progress, but it just, I have the utmost respect uh, for 
those people paving the way for me to be able to like be here today writing songs and making music for a living supporting my family as a as a musician yeah you know and so i wanted to i i did a tribute uh to john lewis uh uh when he passed and i wanted to kind of do uh these next couple of songs kind of as a tribute if that's if that's okay yes, please yeah we'd love to hear that thank you what'd you say we would love to hear that thank oh, you okay, thank cool. you thank you okay Mm. Oh, I should put this on here. Suddenly I'm feeling the coldness in the room. Usually means I've been talking too long. <laughs> I wish that 
that I could share All the love that's in my heart Remove all the bars That keep us apart I wish, I wish you could know What it means to be me Then you'd see and agree that every man should be free mm, I wish I wish I could give all I'm longing to give I wish I could live like I'm longing to live. Oh, I wish, I wish I could do all the things that I can do. Though I'm way overdue. I'd be starting new Well, I wish, I wish I could be Just like a bird in the sky How sweet it would be if I found I could fly Oh, I'd soar I'd soar to the sun And look down at the sea And I'd sing Cause I'd know Yes, I'd sing Cause I'd know Yeah, I'd sing Cause I'd know What it means How it feels To be free Thank you, John Lewis. Thank you, Lewis, for sharing that with us. That is, that's beautiful, man. I really, really appreciated it. This is in the best, best time I have had all year. So thank you very much for uh, for facilitating that and being here with us today. Um, is that um, down to the river to pray? And there's so many wonderful recorded versions of that song. I mean, I, I came across the first time, maybe 16, when Oh Brother, Where Art Thou came out, and that Alison Krauss yeah. version. Yeah. Um, there's Lead Belly, Doc Watts, and Arlo yeah. Guthrie. I mean, so many versions. Was that is that has that song just like always been a part of your reality through the church, or is there a particular is there a, a particular recorded version that really really resonates with you? You know, uh, a little bit of both. I heard it. Uh, you know, uh, the, the, I should say the, the part, the time that I heard it, that it most really kind of got into the fibers of my being was, oh brother, where art thou? You know, it, it just, it struck so many chords of, uh, it hit me in the way of the things hit you that you don't, you didn't know that you already knew. You know, it, it, something in the, in the gene sequence that is my ancestry and uh, you know, I I it, I think that the composer of that song, of that is unknown. It's an old spiritual, probably uh, a, a slave, and um, it's 
you know, it just it re it resonates on those levels, uh, and it, it never left in uh, in that way, and it feels incredibly, um, incredibly uh, honest and authentic to sing it. Yeah, it feels that way. I mean, that, that feeling that you have definitely comes across here in the room. It comes across, I'm positive, to the internet through the, through the tubes, what everybody's hearing right now. So that's a beautiful tribute to John Lewis, man. Thank you very much for sharing with us. And uh, what, what do you feel like, man? Do you feel like closing us out with another tune or do you feel like, uh, what, what do you want to do here? We got time if you, got, if you want to play another one. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, maybe I'll, maybe I'll close out with um, one more. Um, uh while well, we pay it forward by paying it back um, to another um, another one of these giants, uh, regular human beings that lived in a giant way and used their voice in a giant way. Uh, um, Mr. Um, I did a version of uh, Curtis Mayfield's song. It's like it gets colder and colder the more I sit. <laughs> <laughs> the room is actually getting colder. We turned off the heat because it's too loud for the recording, oh. so it has dropped a couple degrees. Oh, okay, that makes yeah. me feel better because I'm like, I'm like, I'm like shivering. I'm, 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 I'm some my my extremities run cold while my core runs warm. It's a very bizarre thing. Um, so I'll try not to shake too much. Um, Figured maybe it's good to end on a hopeful note uh, as he kind of takes that path. The song is called Keep On Pushing. <laughs> to keep on pushing I can't stop now
I'll reach that higher goal Just a little bit of soul Well, I've got my pride And I'll move on aside And keep on pushing Hey, Thank you again for coming and doing it. It really is extra special to be able to do a thing like this in weird, weird times. So thank you for spending your time with us today. And we will stay tuned for when the mirrors record is available. It sounds like it's pretty soon. Yeah. Uh, it's ready to go. And yeah. uh, also when new Louis Cato, uh, when, when solo music is ready to go, we'll just, we'll stay tuned, man. Thank oh, you for man. joining us today. Thanks. Thanks so much again, Brad and Andrew and Cutting Room, all of you guys. All right, man. We'll see you next time. See you next time. All right.